Hello and welcome to Minecraft Dungeon Series. Today I'm going to be showing you all the secret locations located in these missions. Let's get into it. First I'm going to show you the secret location in Creeper Woods. This location is just after the Free the Villager level. It is found just after there. So, let's go free this villager. Alright. First, I'll need to kill all these zombies. Let's just use this TNT. And let's use this shadow potion. Why does, I don't know why that can be so many zombies here at times, but I need this quiver, which is like the best tool in the game. You can pretty much one shot the corrupted cauldron with that. Okay, so we're at the free of the villager. And now we've made all these zombies that are in our way. <laughs> now let's free this guy. Now I can use this TNT and kill this Lombo. And now let's find this secret location. What you need to do once you free the villager, turn left and then go through here until you see an army of mobs. This is the correct location. When you see this strange face carved in that's where you're supposed to be just kill all these mobs around you and you'll be fine go and push this button and then wait for this to open let's use this so this is where your location would be and once you've grabbed it, you've got to kill some mobs. And then you can open this chest and kill all these monsters. Let's kill these zombies. Now let's open this chest and use this turn. And then what's over here? I've forgotten what's over here. Oh, this is the way out. And now you come out of this gate and then as you can see you're at this place which is a bit familiar. Go to the left where these creepers are and now once you get to the end of there you'll be at the giant creeper head. Oh wow, I think I've run the wrong way, but I've definitely found something. 
there are so many mobs in here. And kill them all. And the example to heal up. And then this isn't the real way, it's just part of a secret dungeon. because then we've got to find more locations and some scary men over there take that misters Then, I mean, if you go to the right, you'll see the giant creeper face. And then there's this one creeper that you have to kill, and then you go in there. Now let's just go back to camp and see what other locations you can find. Now I'm going to show you the secret location in Soggy Swamp which is a soggy cave. So, you enter the swamp and you see the witches. Now you've got to find all the brews. Yeah, so you come down here and then you see these secret locations. Let's just go through here. I just use this tool. Kill these skellies. Use bread to heal up. shadow room but then he rocked a shadow room that is it straight I have every single one of you to die and I want to show everybody where this long cave is
Now let's just kill all these witches before I'll show you this soggy cave mission. I've only got one more room to destroy and then they will be off to this soggy this this soggy cave. I better go up to get this room. It's hard to get from down here. I think it will be easy to get if we go up. We'll go off again because I have to kill that zombie. Let's go up and let's go and kill these mobs. It's ready for me. Now let's just go back to finding this soggy cave. So if we have got to go through this cave and then you meet the enderman. They had the easiest boss in the game. And then you've got to go through this cave. This isn't the soggy cave, this is the cave you have to go through before finding this secret mission. Yeah, so you carry on through here to find this mission. Just kill this skeleton, kill this zombie. Kill this witch. We shouldn't even move here. Okay. Oh, it looks like a fawn. Let's just return. Now, let's go find this cave, shall we? exit through this door and you're back in the swamp. Kill some, there are some enemies to kill before you get to this place. This location, just down this way. Just kill all these monsters. Back around this bridge. Go over the bridge again because I realise I'm going the wrong way. Let's go over this bridge. 
mis estudiantes, yo quiero a los zombies. Now, as you come along here, you'll see a little tent with the clients. You know, I want you to go to the left of this tent until you get to this path. As you come along this path, you'll see some more enemies. Just kill them all and try and get to this secret location. And you'll turn to the left here, go over this bridge, kill all these annoying mobs, and then come this way, and then you'll see another door entrance. As you come through here, you'll see that there's a sort of like survive the ambush thing going on. So you'll have to power that beacon. Even though you can already activate it when the gate is shut, which is a bit of a weird thing. Still no them there, yeah. Still no them. Now let's just go through here and you'll see the location. Now as you go out you'll see this thing over here. And you'll go through here and you'll see the exit to your front. Now, I want you to go over and then if you want to finish the boss off, that's fine. If you don't want to, that's fine as well. I am, because I like boss battles. I actually did videos of every boss battle. I've not been ending yet, though. I'm planning on doing that. I'm not doing it. Now let's kill this cauldron, shall we? There we go. It's a bit of an easy boss battle if you've got the Torment Quiver. Torment Quiver. Now I'm going to see the secret location in Pumpkin Pastures. This one's a bit of an easy one. Oh, I've got a soul here. Now let's go and have a look at this secret location in Pumpkin Patches. Now let's find this village. So this is going to be the last one of part one. <coughs> There we go. Now let's just carry on forward. Bye.
by the way, zombie chicken jockeys aren't rare in Minecraft dungeons, so if you see one, you can kill one. Now, now you will need to go over to this pirate ship. Spiders. And go through here. Kill the mobs that are in your way. And then this is where your location will be. So that is the end of part one of the secret locations. Bye bye!